All right, and Reuters team. Susanna Twidal from Reuters. Um, just from, from what you said earlier, I get the impression that you think the EU might be in a position to present its, its target at the um, high-level talks in New York in September. Um, would you expect that to be a realistic place for people to start delivering their pledges? I think it's realistic that people should have done their, their homework and their first reflections. I know that some will not be have finished with all the details, but I, I mean what, what Ban Ki-moon has announced for quite some time ago now, that is that he is hosting this day, a whole day in conjunction with the opening of the UN General Assembly. And there he expects countries to be able to say what are they planning for after 2020? What are they planning to come up with in Paris? Uh, and, and it's not just you know, an exercise where everybody will tell the world all, all the fantastic things they have done up till now. It's actually very deliberate that there is an agenda trying to make also heads of states, the highest political level, reflect upon what are we, what is my country going to, to commit to after 2015. So, of course, he's trying to, to give a push for this. And the, the timing we have in the, in the European Union, that must, of course, be seen in light of that. Uh, I'm sure that for all of us, it goes that to have sort of all the details settled, uh, not to talk about have it as legislative things and all this, that is a challenge for, for really many. But what Ban Ki-moon, as far as I understand, the UN Secretary General, what he has asked for is that everybody starts doing sort of their reflections now in order to give at least a proportion, a, a dimension, uh, when we come to New York. And, and that is why we think after that, we could then start to say, OK, how far did that bring us? How big is the gap now? What do we then do to bridge the gap? That is why this assessment that we have, this component, this time for assess what each other is doing, uh, that that is part of the EU strategy. Thank you very much all for coming. Commissioner, Minister, thank you very much.